Hello and welcome back to another episode of Gears Tactics. My name is Saiken, I'm addicted to Gears Tactics and this is uh, the blind playthrough of Insane Difficulty. Time for Wasteland Sabotage, we're in the veteran mode, 7 out of 20 supreme loot and there are a couple of objectives that need to be done, Fiery Basilisk being one of them. Uh, we gotta blow something up which is great, that also means we have all of our prime team with us. And there is apparently a legendary armor, uh, which you can consider me interested in. We're going to take Gabe. We are going to take Michaela. We are definitely going to take uh, Reyna. And we're going to take Quincy, our new kind of main squad whenever there isn't any um, boss battle around. Sid is great as well, but I just like how Reyna, when she's basically taken his spot, um, Reyna's ability to move behind enemy lines. I want to give this build here another try. We've just seen how well uh, the full focus plus recon works and uh, this here needs to stand the test of time. We do have escape route which will hopefully add quite a bit of uh, pressure to the build uh, because we can re-stealth. I am missing the free cloak. Uh, that is a downside of uh, being forced to scale all the way down to escape route. So what I want to get out of this mission uh, from the scout is I want to observe if this here is worth it or if uh, you effectively need another level to, uh, to, to get this for full uh, comfort. So that's really it. That's my observation for uh, for here. Elsewise, we got some new gear that I want to play with, specifically the sniper scope that allows us to crit harder. And I want to see some big numbers. It's an emulsion stash. The grubs are prepping for their usual bullshit. Blow it with an explosive charge and take out whatever resistance you find. Okay, we're going to take out all of the resistance, rest assured. <clears throat> uh, no one is going to be left standing. We got a target mark for demolition. Nice. It's one of those missions where we gotta reach the objective, the gate first. And we've played a few times on this here. It's one of those situations where you uh, better be aggressive from, uh, from the start. Extra actions, kind of the go-to in those missions, and we're using Rhea to scout ahead. Okay, moving. Can almost charge to the very edge. Support on hand. I don't think she needs the extra AP. I think she's fine. Wait, uh, that's all? Just a few... Just a few hammer burst drones. All right, let's get them all out of cover for now. Oh, we got that utility belt bonus. I'll get there when I get there. Good, let's try something because we're safe. This here should grant her invisibility wouldn't it no see that's the problem there she had killed uh, the guy but he is downed and not completely killed it's a bit of a problem up your game right here it's 
It's not the end of the world because we can still use an execution that allows you to zero in. And there are some more explos uh, explosives. I mean, so far so good. I'm just trying that uh, that cloaking. If she would have been alone, uh, there wouldn't have been an option for her to yeah to to just ignore that. Okay. Moving up. Jack is going to use the sniper aura. Appreciate it, Jack. Okay. All right, that was great. Good. Let's just overwatch for now. You got it. Moving into full cover. Thanks to an incredible amount of of extra actions. Yeah, we can simply move over here. And Gabe moves in as well. Okay, cool. It's a bit of a weak defense. I was hoping for more enemies. <laughs> wow. Okay, so that that's where the reinforcements are coming from. Ready and willing. Heading there now. Oh no, you don't. Good kill. Okay, that's uh, three, um, two for one, three for one. Nice little utility belt into right. hidden. It's not free cloak, but almost as good as free cloak. Standing by. On my way. This is uh, Zealo? Yeah, okay. On it. Good. Jack moves up. And sniper. Begins to move up as well. In transit. Gabe moves up. We're covered here. And that would be a disruption in case the Zealoth actually starts to charge in. See what they got. Walk right into it. Got you now. Eat dirt and die. Now it's on. Well, that's a pretty low chance to hit. Hmm. Ready. Watch me go. Moving to here. What's next? Oh, that's okay. a uh, that's a good shot. Get after it now. Let's see how that epiphany uh, works, because that's uh, every single shot is a cooldown uh, reduction. Gonna need some ammo. I got nothing. 
Well. Enemy down. Overall, not bad. We haven't really used a lot of cooldowns. Yes, with the scout, but for the rest, I read you. Pretty much no. Yeah, I can see how the, the new equipment becomes more and more powerful over time. Again, we've got incoming. Yeah. Been looking forward to this. Good support aura. That means cooldown reduction for every Beautiful. single one of you guys. And I think next turn almost everybody should have cooldowns reduced. Let's do it. Okay. There, there. Jack's the only one with cooldowns left over. And that's fine. Uh, I would like to get the sniper aura back. So let's give it two more turns. Watch it! Here they come. We can I think go in this turn. Next turn we can use the cool uh, the sniper aura. plenty of enemies none of them directly inside yet Jack helps everybody to move a bit faster to wherever they want to go Waiting. starting with a scout All the way up. There are a couple of snipers yes. up here. Top. I'm on it. Good. Just in case someone moves down Got here, we're ready. Gabe, what am I going to do with you? Do we want to potentially start moving in from this side? Heavy here. I think we can do that with a heavy. Acknowledged. On Overwatch. Good. And yeah, Jack just stays invisible for now. Okay, next turn's potentially one of those where the sniper will get a lot of kills. Excuse me. Well, maybe not. They seem to think that they rather should stay all back. Okay, so how are we going to deal with that? I believe... Let's think that through. Deviant Sniper over here. That's far. Question that I'm asking myself is how aggressive do we want to go in with a scout? Okay, moving. So moving as far as we can for now. Yes. 
giving them a 20% damage bonus. Time to up your game. Yeah, Jax, it will be Jax's turn soon. Let's Ready. first of all stick with the scout and finish the train of thought here. So that should take care of him. Not optimal. What we could do is do this here and plant this here. I don't want to lose my concealment, not yet. Next turn we can assassinate him. He does he just know that we're there. Just a few targets. Again, just a few targets. Not really worth our time. We move over here and keep that zealoth at bay. This is a bit of an aggressive move because he has a huge reach for attacks of opportunity. Anyone back here that is a problem? No, plenty of drones and tickers that really don't do much. Affirmative. See the objective. That guy could be a problem. Bring that is likely not rate. going to do anything. 50% extra damage. Yes, please. Sniper aura. Yes, please. Yeah, I don't want to move in. The snipers could take uh, Jack out. If I move over here, we're effectively saying the scout needs to deal with all of these guys by themselves. This here would be a compromise position. Compromise between helping on this end and theoretically being able to go to the other side. Sure thing. But we're not we're not forced to do anything stupid this time. We got search. I would like to keep that. Although Searching here wouldn't be bad. Okay. And now is a decent turn for it. Yeah, let's go for it. Typically, I use it on the sniper. Scanning now. Good. Very aggressive movement from our side. Trying to keep uh, capture that right uh, right hand zone. Oh, 
Oh, that seal of hers has a bad time. Surprisingly well. Okay, lots, lots and lots of tracking. <laughs> Interesting. Reading you. Okay, so this turn is yeah. the turn, which means. We're rocket loading. Oh, it's on now. It's definitely on. That's a good old fifty percent damage bonus. Jack finally can sprint in. That's a kill and a uh, massive uh, bit of damage. Jumping up and say hello to a thousand four hundred points of damage. Nice little crit. And whilst we're at it. This here makes us invisible and everybody else just, just gets a lot of action points. I'm listening. Good, we are ready. Moving up. Two thousand five hundred damage. Wow. Damn right, target is down. Oh, I should have. Uh, I should have used ultimate shot. My bad. Okay, okay, well, that could have been easily avoided. I should have used. I. For some reason, I forgot that I moved her over here, and in my mind, it was like, yeah, we still got plenty of action units left over, right? On the move. Okay. Uh -huh. Go ahead. Slowly moving up, and in the meantime, it's going to be our Overwatch. Jack is very soon going to move up, and in the meantime, Diaz is going to overwatch in this direction. Just waiting for that sniper to move. <laughs> the overwatch is so strong. No quarter. 
That was fun as well. Slowly but surely, we're chewing through all of them. All right. Got one. Not bad. Good. We got empower again, which is exactly what we will need. another sniper down and double shot into his back which makes us um, invisible again so I suppose we do not need uh, the empower because that was just a backup plan in case it wouldn't work yeah awaiting order after that. Moving over. Bit of an explosive shot. I was hoping that Eliminated. we would get the guy. Bring it on, I'm ready. Anyways, moving up there. Supporting in. Moving up over here. Got it. Feels good, huh? Good. If we could get up here, we would potentially be in a super strong position so a sniper begins to move over and we're going to yes. take them from the left side jack begins to move up and hide and we Later, got jack. one more overwatch On the lookout. gabe is doing a fantastic job this uh in turn the support skills are super helpful. Right in the crosshairs. But the interruption is also incredibly strong. The guy couldn't even do something. Time to shred some grubs. On my way. Ready. Good, running and yeah. gunning. Let's hand over Get some actions. Two thousand five hundred on a crit. That's just got him. Should be forbidden. Oh, please. Oh, I forgot I should have looted the last crate first. That was a good knock. I still a bit dizzy by the high numbers. Sniper damage up to 2,600 points. Holy moly, that's a lot of damage. And we got a Grenadier Legendary uh, Vest. Just getting better. I wonder what that is. We already, the utility belt already gives us one 
AP back on on a successful utilization of the grenade. So that's almost a util, uh, utility point for free. First grenade essentially is for free. If Grenadier now allows us to reset the grenade to zero cooldown, I don't know. Oh, this is, that would be obscene. 10 kills. That's a lot. Good. Let's double check Rhea here. Grenadier. 50% uh, um, to grenades. That's even more damage. When this unit uses a frag or stim grenade, 20% chance to... <laughs> okay, it is indeed uh, completely crazy. Like, there is a 20% chance uh, she could throw a second grenade. Utility belt. First time, frag or stim grenade. It gets one action, so... If both trigger, you did not even use a time uh, action, but it is completely for free. No cooldown, nothing. You just dealt damage as if nothing would have happened. Wow. Uh, the restealth, by the way, kind of debrief of my viewpoint is there. Escape route is great, but the finisher doesn't uh, work very well. Double shot, however, seems to work better. The 25% damage bonus is good because that also applies to grenades. So that skill itself is great. Uh, this year I haven't really per uh, mastered that skill yet. This, on the other hand, could be a strong skill as well. Just gaining free actions. Specifically, it say, it doesn't say that you need to. It doesn't say um, that it caps with one action. Say if we're um, killing three or four with a grenade from uh, being hidden, that would, in my reading, mean we have three or four actions. This here is useless for us, but that's pretty good. Um, free Cloak, however, is also quite good. So I think Assassination might actually take it. Not sure. It's a good skill. So let's see. We got a couple more Supreme Loot items here. Whenever you kill an enemy, it gets a... Um, it gets a 25% chance. Oh. oh. Okay. So that's essentially one of those bombing missions. This here is again a bombing mission. Um and this here i think is one of those um this is one of uh, those hold the ground missions they need to figure out what those symbols uh, mission symbols mean but yeah i'll read through them uh, between now and the next uh, time and we will uh, get going there are a lot of supreme mods that we still need to get and i'm getting more motivated uh, now that i'm seeing the large numbers than before thank you for watching guys and if you enjoy it leave a comment and a like down below and we see each other in veteran mode very soon Bye bye